Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Winter Park, Florida. Uh, NXT is getting ready for New Year's Evil next week. I'm so excited for it. Um, but before we get into any of that, with me as always, the freak of NXT, Humanoid. How are you today, sir? I'm doing awesome. Uh, I'm just going to... Winter Park, Florida? Yeah, we're yeah, in Florida is kind of is weird. I never knew there was a winter park. Well, it's getting something new every day. Well, it's getting hot in here with Nikki Bella coming down the entranceway. <laughs> Pretty much, like it is getting hot in here, Nikki Bella. <laughs> and with that being, and with that being said, sir, we're gonna let the entrances go, and we're gonna start when the action happens. Representing Toxic Attraction from Atlanta, Georgia, Gigi Dolan. So Nikki Bella going one on one with our girl Gigi. Are you excited for this, sir? Simps is what I call her. Because everybody is simping over her. Listen, brother. When you got it, you got it. Yeah, she, she got it. She got it. Oh, she Two missed the, the kick. Ropes. Two. Oh, she did miss the kick. Oh, a takedown. Yep, there you go, there you go. Oh, the rope break is on. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting rope breaks. To the top rope is Gigi gonna fly. See, I can't wait for uh, our WrestleMania, which is gonna be held by ECW. And with that, sir, I don't know if you know the ECW rules, but it's knockout, pinfall, submission, weapons, falls count anywhere. Yeah, it wouldn't be ECW if it was, wasn't the falls count anywhere. That's how ECW is. Exactly, brother. Ooh, there you go, Nikki. Nice collar tie up. Two in a row. Yep. There you go. Nikki Drop toe hold. Nikki is down. Gigi goes for the pin. Yep. Ooh, uh, kick out at one. Oh, a kick out. There you go. Going for the takedown. Missed it. To her midsection. Kick to the midsection. Boom. Oh, an X Factor by Nikki. Love it. Ooh, kick out. Ooh, still looking kick good, right? Still looking go good, Gigi. right? Pick her up. And Gigi. Nice. Love it. Drop, toe hold. Yes, put her another. There you go. There you go, but she's right by the ropes. Half a sharpshooter. Yep, yep. She does half a sharpshooter. Nikki might, Nikki might go for those, Nikki, she's smart, go for those, okay, well, she said, fuck it, I'm going to fight out of it. Pick her up. And picking her up, what's she going to do? Ooh, oh, no, she doesn't. I will say this right now, if I ever was a wrestler, I would refuse the over-the-top rope spot, fuck that. But yeah, because you can land outside and it's going to hurt either way. Exactly. Oh shit. Nice. Come on, Gigi. Get back up. Yep. Oh, she's gonna work the hair, Nikki! Oh, not the hair. Nikki. Fuck. Not the hair. That. And she stopped running. Yep, she yep, stopped yep. Away from... we're, I don't we're... know what this veteran is. Tr oh my god, I called her a veteran. I don't know why this <laughs> yeah. veteran is thinking. <laughs> Listen, she's uh, a Hall okay. of Famer, man. She is a Hall of Famer. Oh my god, this 
much as I don't want that community. She is a Hall of Famer. Respect. Really, like, my mouth. <laughs> Respect the GOAT that is Nikki Bella. Respect the GOAT. Get out of here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this uh, show is sponsored by Trojan. Uh, Trojan. Always wear protection. Yep. Always uh, wear a raincoat. Is she gonna tap out? Oh, Nikki! Nikki, do not tap out. Nikki, you can fight it. There you go. There you go. There you go. You can fight out of it. There you go. Oh, she fought out of it. She's punching her in the face. Yep, yep, yep. Love it. And block! Oh, nice! Oh, monkey flip! Yep. To the middle of the ring. You can't see me. Oh my god, did I just see that? You did! Humanoid makes his first Cena reference! Oh, love it. Cena's <laughs> uh, not even here yet. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, the freak of NXT loves his himself some John Cena. I gotta admit, I used to hate him, but now I enjoy him. Like, like, listen, wasn't that bad. listen, there's two John Cena fans. There's two John Cena fans. There's the diehard John Cena fans and the closet John Cena fans. Well, my, listen, 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 yeah. me and my brother got back into watching, watching this around the same time, around like 2003. We got back into watching wrestling and I was an instant John Cena fan. Loved him. And my brother was like, I fucking hate John Cena, blah, blah, blah. He just last year admitted to me that he secretly liked John Cena. And I'm like, I fucking knew you did. I knew it. Well, here's the thing, though. When he first started the Fugonomics, I loved that guy. You can't see me and all that. Oh, three! Damn. Uh, yeah. When he first did the Fugonomics thing, that was great. I loved him in that. When he could rap and all that. Then he won the WWE title and he just started winning and winning and winning. I go like, oh my god, this guy. <laughs> and that's when the Cena hate started. But now, like, I starting to like him again because even though he's not there all the time, yep. he comes back part time. I enjoy him. Oh, but up next. Maybe it's because I had to uh, not see him for many times. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to let the entrances play, and we're going to go when that bell rings. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Madrid, Spain, weighing in at 154 pounds, Axia! his opponent from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 183 pounds, Wes Lee! Ladies and gentlemen, if you remember correctly, Axiom actually faced Logan Paul, uh, I don't think it was last... Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments. I don't believe it was last week, but I think it was our week returning. He fought L Logan Paul, and he impressed me, man. But um, what's his chances against Wes Lee here tonight? I say 50-50, because Wes Lee is pretty amazing as well. Okay. Like one half, one half of the former tag team of MSK, and I'm still trying to figure out what that means, MSK. It means... It means, my God, skilled kickboxers. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> my God! Fan theory, fan theory, they say, like, MSK stands for Marijuana Smoking Crew or something like that. I mean, but why, though? That just seems... 
I don't want to say that seems silly, but that seems like something like uh, that would be spread around oh the God, playground. The Airplane spin. Let's go, Wesley. Sorry, what you were saying? That that seems like the kind of name that would be spread around the playground. Like, yo, you never guess what I found that MSK stands for. Marijuana Smoker Crew. And then be like, no way, you know? Oh, shit. Like, that type of shit. Yeah. I don't know. It just, it just seems silly, but maybe it's silly enough to make sense. I don't know. Boom! Well, the Titatron was green and smoky, so... Who right. Oh, Axiom Sight. He never once had a marijuana gimmick. Oh, shit, Wesley got Axiom down. Yep, oh, shit, oh, shit, cover! Nope, absolutely the, not. The, the same thing can be said for WCW's Chronic. Mmm, true. Tag team. True. They were supposed to be a Wii, a Wii tag team, but they were never once high. They were just... Destroying stuff. Right. Ooh, kick out. Kick out at one. Damn, Maxim. And boom, next forearm smash. Love it. I would say Wesley is the future of NXT. I would agree. Yes, he is. Boom, he nice elbow. Really Do something great. with it. Oh, where is he going? Oh. Whoa! Outside 619. Damn, that was beautiful. But yes, you need to capitalize with it. You need to capitalize with it. Do something. Oh, shit. Spinning corkscrew moonsault. That's a mouthful. Holy oh, shit. All right. Damn. Real quick. Wesley gets the win. He might be a threat to Logan Paul, man. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, hopefully, yes. Damn. Oh yeah, Logan Paul's champion, right? Yep, he's our cruiserweight champion. Hopefully Wesley gets a title shot. Hopefully. Maybe we'll see him uh, next week at New Year's Evil. We'll definitely see. New Year's Evil. <laughs> so up next, triple your boy threat. Jinder Mahal in a triple threat with Chris Masters and Lance Archer. Oh, well, that's Lance Archer, the murder hawk. I was wondering, wait, who is that in the right? <laughs> Yeah, Lance Archer, the right, Chris Masters, middle, and Jinder Mahal on the left. Yeah. Damn. Well, so, like I said, usually I would go for Jinder, but he's been on a losing streak except for the last week. Yep. So, if I say he's going to lose, he wins. If, if I say he's going to win, he loses. So, I don't know what to say anymore. Well, I'm going with my boy Chris Masters on this one. I'm going to go with the Burner Hawk. Well, we'll definitely see. We will definitely see. And his opponents first. From Punjab, India, weighing in at 238 pounds, the modern-day Maharaja, Jinder Mahal! And from New York, weighing in at 270 pounds, the superstar, Lance Arthur. All right, come on, Chris. Come on, Chris. There you go. Go after the threat. Go after the threat. There you go, Chris. Did you ever enjoy Lance Archer's tag team with Baby Boy Smith, the Killer Elite Squad? Did I? You were a big team in Japan. Oh, that's why I didn't hear about it, because I didn't watch uh, New Japan stuff. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Baby Boy Smith? Really? Yeah. Wow, that's... 
That's, Black Charger were tagged you for quite a while. That's crazy, man. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Were they oh, a menace like rated R like rated RKO or or were they just beasts? Um, from what I remember they were like beasts. I don't know, people in the comments let me know what you think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let us know because I don't know yeah. anything about that stuff. Yeah. But they had a great name, Killer Elite Squad. Ooh. Ooh, nice. Oh, gender has a chair. All is legal and a triple threat. Yep. Oh, Master's saying absolutely not. Get him. Oh, Shut him. he got him in the Master Lock Challenge. Get it. Who? No, not the Master. Ooh, he kicked him a referee by accident. And the referee gets up right away. What was oh, that? Dude, I'm still in shock. Why would he kick the ref? Well, by, uh, it was by accident. He was trying to hit Jinder. Okay, uh, true. Okay, Jinder did go for the, 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 cup, the kick out thing. Oh, nice shoulder block. And blah! There you go. Lance Archer goes down. Chris Masters looks like he's getting it. <sighs> Damn it! Ooh, pick him up, Tinder. There you go. Oh, that's a good move by Tinder. Yes. And it looks like Tinder is dominating. It's yeah, it does seem like it. it seemed like his his loss at the big show must have uh, lit a fire in his ass. Lit a fire in his ass, yeah. But now, if he could get a win over over two beasts like Chris Masters and. Uh, and Lance, I mean, that has to prove that maybe he is a threat to uh, oh, to uh, Garcia. To yep. Catch my three bound. Nice, Jinder. Holy shit. Oh. No, 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 no. Nice. Nice breaking up. <laughs> oh, shit. Cheer for Ginger, but I know what happens if I do. I know, man. <laughs> but if I, but if I don't, he wins. It's true. Yeah. What's this curse of all about? <laughs> it's that Dan Housen curse. You bank has. It's a Dan Housen curse. Yeah. Dan Housen, very nice guy, very evil. <laughs> oh, chair shots. Damn. Hey, hey, watch your legs. There you go, Chris. Chris, stay out of it. If you don't need to be in it, stay out of it. I guess Chris wants to put enough punishment on both on just Jinder. Oh, fuck, Jinder! No! Oh, fuck. Nice block, nice block. So did you the did you see the PlayStation showcase? Showcase. Yeah, they're remaking Metal Gear Solid Snake Eater. Oh shit! Oh, okay, that's interesting. Oh, I fucking love it. And and uh, the the, the Venom suit is available for uh, Spider-Man Two. Oh, uh, I saw a clip of that. Yeah, Spider-Man Two looks fucking beautiful, I'm man. Miles, I like to see how that game goes because I enjoyed the Spider-Man game and the Miles Morales one. Yeah. Did you play them and put them on your channel? I'm sorry, what? Did you play them and put them on your channel? Oh, no, I was playing them separately. Oh, okay, okay. What do you record and put on your channel? Um, depends on what I like to do that day. Okay. Depends. <laughs> and depends diapers. <laughs> Sponsor. Really depends. Ladies and gentlemen, this uh, this uh, show is sponsored by Depends. It depends on what kind of night you are feeling. It depends. <laughs> Chris! They're spending a lot of time on the outside. They are, they are. Oh, crawl, why would you do that, Chris? Oh, Jinder. Jinder. Jinder! Watch out! Busting him oh, open. Jinder's Oh my god, there you go, Chris. 
Be the big dog of NXT. Come on now. Be the big dog bring of NXT. Bring it back inside the ring. Somebody needs to bring it back in the ring. It's not a false count anywhere. See, I was hoping that Jinder would have uh, been the big dog of uh, NXT. Nice! Yeah, me too, but you know what happens when you cheer for Jinder. Mm-hmm. You hinder his Jinder. The Jinder curse. Yeah. The hinder Jinder curse. <laughs> Toss him back in, Lance. Toss him. There Sorry. we go. Get back in the ring. Here we now go. Now we're back in the ring. Yep. Chris, no. Get oh, in. Oh, they're back outside. Get back in that ring. Oh, shit. Caught a kendo to the... Get back in the goddamn ring. Oh. Everybody, get in this fucking ring. Get in the ring right now. That's why I hate outside work. I hate outside work. Yeah. Right back and then, way too long. then when there is a ten count, if if it passes six, then I'm like, all right, get in the fucking ring. Exactly. I'm, but I'm just saying, for Triple Fred, yeah, sure, no ten count for the first like two times you're outside. But if you keep going out, if you're staying out there for more than that, then apply the ten count. Right. Oh, he really this wants is, to use those is, stairs. This, this is getting kind of ridiculous now. Yep. And they're back outside. I'm so happy someone else gets my anger for outside work. Yeah, if, if I get, like I said, like I don't mind it, but if it just wastes their time all the time out there, right. then it's annoying. Chris, 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 fix all this. Fix all this, put them both in the ring. They go into the barricade. No one messes with the barricade. Yep. Oh yeah, you're not from here. Okay, we got a local wrestler here, independent wrestler named the Barricade. Oh. And that's his signature. That's it. Like whenever he comes out, he always says like, "Nobody crosses the Barricade." Oh Jesus. And. Out to the Barricade if he's watching. Probably not, but shout out to me. <laughs> Oh, nice. Oh, people, get in the fucking... Get in the damn ring. <laughs> Your Honor, I'd like to motion to carry... I don't know. Everyone's just fighting now. Jesus Christ. Yeah. There needs to be rules in place, sir. Get in the ring! Get in the goddamn ring! Use the pipe? Yep! Boom! Holy shit! Oh, right on his back. And he ran into a Samoan drop! And he gets right up from that. What? Oh, nice clothesline to the outside. Beautiful. Sir, I plead that you get in the goddamn ring. <laughs> the next person to get the entire crew into the ring gets a world title shot at the next big show. Watch them go back inside. <laughs> that was the As soon as you say that. Okay. <laughs> Oh! They don't give a fuck. I just want to beat. Damn it, Chris! Oh my god, Chris. You're just <laughs> destroying me. Now, put him in the ring. There you put go. Him in the ring. Good, good. Now, Jinder. Let's go away, Jinder. Oh my there you god. Go. Get in the ring, Jinder. There he goes. Sign, finally, someone can end this. Oh, end it. End it, Jinder. Oh, back elbow lands. Oh, murder hog. Just. Uh oh, Jinder saying no. Nope. Oh, Jinder got out of it. Reverse cutter. Yep. Nope, oh, Master Lock. Master Lock, can he do it? Oh, no. no he can't. Never mind. Nice swinging neck breaker. Neck breaker. Yep. 
I swear to God, if everyone goes outside again, I'm gonna lose my shit. Yes, I'm safe, safe. Come on, Tinder. I, I like you, but come on, do something. <coughs> End it. End it already. Cover? There is it gonna happen. One. Oh, two. Chris, man. Oh, no. That's what I said. I got the Tinder curse every time I cheer for him. Oh, okay, it's over. No, it's it can't be. Break. There you go, Chris. <laughs> not over yet. It's not over. No, not to the outside again. Yep. Yep. Welcome to NXT, where everyone wants to fight on the outside. Exactly. Oh, okay, it's one-on-one -on -one now. Oh, Bernard yep. just got back up right up. Oh, he's got the sledgehammer. Oh, to the ass. He got him in the ass. Yep. Or the lower back. Cover, cover, count it! Cover one, one, two. Oh, Lance, it's there over. you go. It's over, it's finally over. Holy shit. Here is your winner. Holy yeah, shit. See what I mean by the, the Jinder Mahal curse? Yep. Damn! That was a beautiful co-main event. Holy shit. I like it, except for when you spend too much time outside the damn ring. Yep. LA Knight versus Luchasaurus. Okay, here we go. Here we go. So who are you predicting? Oh, tough one to call right here. Mm-hmm. Tough one to call. What's your gut say? Ellie Knight. Alright, let's, let's see. And his opponent from California weighing in at 275 pounds. The Luchador Dino. Yeah, it seems like seems like uh, we got us a darker Luchasaurus here tonight. Boom! Yeah, ever since he got, ooh, maybe over right now. Ever since he got rid of Jungle Boy, he's become more darker. Yeah. Literally wearing black. And pop him! Get him, LA! Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah. Same. What? No, that was a terrible stone cold. What the fuck was that? What? There was we go. What? Better. <laughs> that was bad. What? what? Oh, work on the leg. Luchasaurus, there you go. Got him in the leg. Yep. LA's Come on, LA. Oh, it may be over. No, 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 it can't be. It can't be. Oh, you did a Yokozuna. Yep. Is it over? Shades to a great world champion, Yokozuna. Boom! What? Was he, though? Yeah, he was. For his time, I don't know. It seems like back in the gold golden days, they yeah, were great good big good guys. Point. But, it, but like, Big Daddy V, the Umaga, like, they never made him a world champion. Who, Big Daddy V? Oh uh, well, both. Or both. No, no. Was Big Big Daddy V the ECW World Champion at one point? No, he never was. Are you sure? Yes, he never was World Champion. That was Mark Henry you're thinking of. No, no. I think they made Big Daddy V World Champion too. No, no. That was Mark Henry. Right, you're right. Two that I know. Dudes. That I know. Mark Henry. He's not that. He's just big. Right. Well, I know that Mark uh, Mark was world champion. Win, maybe? Let's see. I will look it up. Right after we're done with all this, I'm gonna look it up. Oh, one uh, count. This was a form, Big Daddy B, former tag team champion, former hardcore champion. Really? 
Fuck, man. See, they ruined things, man. Who did? Big Daddy V? No, well, everything. They fucking like, like he he would have been a great world champion. No, he wouldn't. He was horrible. You shut you you shut your whore mouth. You shut your whore Wait, mouth. You like Big Daddy V? I didn't mind him. It's over. It's, it's over, Lee. Ladies and gentlemen, leave us awesome. leave us your opinion of Big Daddy V. But with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, Humanoids links will always be in the description below. And next week and is New Year's too. Evil. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. And the cat's Twitter is also available. Since <laughs> and also Big Daddy V is awful. <laughs> with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Peace.